And so begin to close the mouth, finding that natural rhythm in and out through the nose. You may want some support under the knees or just allow the legs to soften, the feet softening out to the edges of the mat. And it is time for our yoga nidra. It's best that you remain still during yoga nidra so that both your body and brain have the chance to fully relax. If you do become uncomfortable, it's okay to change position. The practice of yoga nidra is a practice of yogic sleep that will guide you through the hypnotic state, the state of consciousness between being awake and asleep. Try to remain awake by listening to the sound of my voice and you'll be asked to move through your awareness to various body sensations emotions and images. So try not to concentrate too intensely as it may prevent you from not relaxing. So during this meditation, use or absorb what you need in the moment and then you just leave it behind. And if the mind becomes overactive where thoughts and worries come up, just come back to my voice. There's no right or wrong. Just allow yourself to be. Become aware of any sounds you can hear in this moment. Nothing else but what you can hear without strain. And begin to focus on the most distant sound that you can hear. And let your sense of hearing radiate outward, searching out these distant sounds and following them for a few moments. Move your attention from sound to sound without labeling the source. Gradually bring your attention to closer sounds, to the sounds outside of your home, or to the sounds inside your space, to the room. And without opening your eyes, visualize the four walls of this room, the ceiling, the floor, and your body lying on the floor. And visualize your body as it lay on the floor, the position, your clothes, your hair, your face. Become acutely aware of your existence, of your physical body while you lay on the floor. Become aware of your natural breath. Become aware of your natural and spontaneous breath that moves in and out of your body without any effort. The natural breath flows in through both nostrils. Notice the feeling of the breath as it comes in 
and out of your nostrils. There is a sense of coolness as you inhale the breath. Follow this feeling into your nose, your sinuses, the back of your throat, into your lungs. There is a sense of warmth as you exhale the breath. Feel this warmth on your upper lip as you breathe out. The natural breath flows through your nostrils during the inhale and exhale. Allow your breath to become longer and slower. Take a long and slow inhalation. Followed by a longer exhalation. Make your exhale even slower and notice the slight pause after you exhale. Make your inhale slower, even slower than your exhale and then pause. Feel the urge to breathe bubble up inside of you and when you need to exhale, let it go. Longer and slower as you inhale and exhale. Now begin to go back to your natural breath, releasing any control over the inhale or exhale. Practice of Yoga Nidra begins now. At this moment, you should make a sankalpa, a resolve or an intention, anything that is short and positive simple language, just discover one naturally, see what comes up. State your sankalpa clearly and with awareness three times. The sankalpa or intention you make during yoga nidra plants a seed in the fertile soil of your mind to bring about transformation and healing. Also say to yourself, now I am practicing yoga nidra. I am awake and relaxed. I am practicing yoga nidra. I am awake and relaxed. We now begin a systematic journey of sensory awareness throughout your body and you will move your awareness to different parts as soon as you hear them named. The practice begins on the right side, right hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel, sole of the foot, top of the foot, right big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe, left hand thumb, second finger, 
third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel, sole of the foot, top of the foot, left big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Now go to the back of the body, right heel, left heel, right calf, left calf, right thigh, left thigh, right buttocks, left buttocks, lower back, middle back, upper back, the entire spine, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, back of the neck, back of the head, top of the head, forehead, right temple, left temple, right ear, left ear, right elbow, left elbow, middle of the eyebrows, right eye, left eye, right nostril, left nostril, right cheek, left cheek, right side of the chest, left side of the chest, upper abdomen, navel, lower abdomen, right groin, left groin, the pelvic floor, left side of the chest, upper abdomen, navel, lower, groin, the pelvic floor, the whole right leg, the whole left leg, the whole right arm, the whole left arm, the whole face, the whole head, the whole torso, the whole body, the whole body, the whole body, lightness and heaviness. Now imagine the whole body becoming light, as though your body could float away from the floor and towards the ceiling. The head is light and weightless, the limbs light and weightless, the torso light, weightless. The whole body is light and weightless. You're rising higher and higher away from the floor. Now imagine your body becoming heavy. Feel the heaviness in all parts of your body. Each part is becoming heavier and heavier and heavier. The head heavy, the limbs are heavy, the torso heavy, the whole body heavy, so heavy that it's sinking down to the floor. Awaken the experience of cold, the experience of chilly cold. Imagine being outside in winter without enough clothing. You feel a chill permeating your entire body. Now allow the sensation of warmth to spread throughout the entire body. Remember the feeling of heat in summer when you're out in the sun and there's no shade. 
heat radiating onto the skin, heat all around your body, on your face. Now allow the feeling of complete calm come to the entire body. Manifest the experience of calm to your entire mind, body, and your emotions. You are relaxed and aware. You are completely calm. Begin to concentrate on a space in front of your closed eyelids. Imagine before you a transparent screen as though you were at the movie theater. The screen is as high and as wide as your eyes can see. Concentrate on this mind screen and become aware of anything that manifests within, any colors, patterns, light. Whatever you see is the manifesting state of your mind. Continue your awareness on this space, but don't come too involved. Practice detachment. Just become aware of what you can see. If any subtle images make themselves known, simply notice them without directing the images. If thoughts occur, let them come and go. But watching the dark space, continue this detached awareness. Now a number of different things will be named. You should envision them on the level of emotion, memory, and imagination as best you can. Just jump from image to image as soon as you hear it. Red desert, peacock feather, Buddha meditating, doctor's office, a good night's rest, full moon, your reflection in a mirror, foggy morning, waiting for results, sun shining overhead, a bouquet of flowers, tallest tree, receiving help from others, cool, clear water, making appointments, a relaxing afternoon, laughing with friends, a warm embrace, a burning candle, temple on a mountain, a path in the woods, a vibrant sunset, taking a deep breath, a cat stretching, a beautiful garden path, your favorite song, the sound of my voice, and your body lying on the floor. It is time to re repeat your sankalpa, your intention, the statement that you made at the beginning of your practice. Say this now mentally three times. And come back to the feeling of your breath flowing in and out your nostrils. Maintain your awareness of breath.
and begin to develop the same awareness of your physical body. Your body relaxed and lying on the floor. Feel the container of your skin and the clothes and props that are touching you. Notice the heaviness of your body as it rests on the floor and take your awareness into all parts, all points of the body that are touching the floor, the back of your heels or bottom of your feet, your thighs, shoulders, arms, hands, your head. Begin to, in your mind's eye, visualize your room, your space, the four walls, ceiling, and the floor. Imagine in your mind's eye, your room, you laying there and any objects that may be in the room as you begin to bring yourself back to your space. You may want to Gently begin to deepen through your breath. Just filling the body with energy, with life. You may want to bring some gentle movement to your body or you're welcome to stay nice and still. Maybe stretching out the arms or the legs or the feet, the toes. And just in your own time, there's absolutely no hurry. You may want to gently hug the legs in. Just sweeping body from side to side. Until you're ready to come down to your favorite side. Just taking a moment to give thanks to yourself for arriving on the mat for your practice. Knowing yourself this time. If you can, keeping the eyes closed, bringing yourself up to a comfortable seat. And we take the hands to Anjali Mudra at the heart. Take a nice big deep breath in through the nose. And exhale. 
We'll finalize our class with one round of OM if you'd like to join me. So we'll inhale to OM, so inhale. Let me take that hand to your eyebrow center and bow forward to our internal selves. Om Shanti Shanti Shanti. May there be peace, may there be peace, may there be peace. Namaste.